In this video, we're going to show you some of the things we bought for our new townhouse in Orlando. Stay tuned. We'll be right back. Welcome back to The Long Run with Joel and Christy. I'm Joel. And I'm Christy. Um, if you have been following us for a little while, you know that we have a sinking fund for household essentials. Mm -hmm. When we knew that we were moving, we thought there might be a chance that we might need to buy some things here. So we bulked that up as much as possible. Coronavirus made it a little more difficult, but we bulked it up and we had extra money in that sinking fund for uh, buying things for the townhome. So we thought we would show you some of the things that we bought. We haven't finished completely, but I don't know, you know, who knows. <laughs> so here we go, let's take a look at those things. So here's what we got, our first haul, like we probably will have more at the end of this video of other things that we've had to buy, uh, but this was the first thing. Uh, when we lived in Houston, our son's bathroom had a walk-in shower with the glass door, so he didn't need a shower curtain. But here, they're, it's, they're both open, so we needed a, another shower curtain because of that. So we got a shower curtain, we got two shower liners, one for each bathroom, and a shower rod, and the little rings? Yep. Rings. Thank you. Um, in Houston, I had, uh, we had like a closet that I could hang my apron on. Here, there isn't one, so we just bought a hook that we put, we're going to put in the pantry and just hang the apron off of that. So, that's for, uh, technically, I guess you could say we would have had to buy this even if we hadn't moved, you know, because mm -hmm. we were getting close to being out anyway. Same thing with our toothpaste and facial wash and mouth rinse and razor blades. Um, got uh, myself and my and our son a puff. Joel doesn't use those. No. Nope. He uses bar soap. So, yep. anyway. Old school. Old school. Uh, we got a few replacement flower sack towels. The Walmart brand is not my favorite and we'll probably like either look online for some more, but um, they, they were pretty old, the ones that we have and stained. And, and I feel like you have to replace them like every six months or so, you have to get some new ones so they'll be nice and fresh and clean. So that, Again, another thing that we would have had to buy anyway. Uh, finally, we got this. And um, in Houston, we had a lot of uh, drawers in our kitchen that we were able to put things like zip, zip lock bags and plastic wrap and stuff like that. Here, we do not have that. It, and so what I did was put it in the pantry, but I'm going to put them all inside this basket so we can just pull out the basket when we need zip locks or something or plastic wrap or something so that's what that's for and we also got one of these mats for our kitchen to go underneath the sink okay here are a few more things that we got from walmart to for the new apartment we got a welcome mat um that's a it's not a blackout curtain what is it it's a room darkening curtain a uh, room darkening curtain for the window over here uh, or the sliding glass door over here on the, uh, behind the couch. And then uh, we have less storage space in our bathroom, so we're going to try to use that in one of the bathrooms to help a little bit with our storage issue. Okay, so we went to Walmart, got a few more things for our new townhome. Uh, we got a toilet tissue holder for the half bath. We didn't have a half bath in the apartment, so we, you know, uh, so we just needed something to put our toilet tissue in. We got a towel to hang on the rack, so, you know, clean your hands, and a bath mat for in front of the sink. And uh, then we also got a, um, what do you call that? The bathtub mat. A bathtub mat for our shower, because I noticed that every time I get in the shower, um, I'm slipping on that one because there's nothing, uh, no rough bottom on it like we had in our other apartment. And um, 
Then we also got this um, basket. <laughs> I can't think of words today. We got this basket to go in our pantry for us to throw our um, used flower sack towels in and then uh, I can just take it upstairs where the washer and dryer is when I have a few in it. So those are a few of the things that we bought uh, with our um, uh, bulked up uh, um, household, essentials. household essentials fund. Uh, we did buy a few things, had, had to buy a few things. We actually did buy one more thing last night that we'll probably report on later. Yeah. Uh, but that was because we were able to save up some money and uh, didn't have to go into debt to buy to buy it. So, uh, so there you go. So don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell for updates from us. Hit one of those videos that's floating around here. Uh, check out some more content from us. But uh, for today, that's the long run with Joel and Christy. I'm Joel. And I'm Christy. And we'll see you next time. Bye.